This is my intro song. It isn't very long. That's all. Go ahead. Go on, watch the video. Hello, my loves. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Sending my love to all of you. Hope you are all doing fantastic. I'm doing well. So today we are going to be working on our right hand. And I got these press it tips. These are the older Gelex tips, but they was on sale for $10 at the nail supply. So I got these and I was like, yeah, I'm gonna do that. So I'm gonna give myself a little, you know, mani, um, pushing back my cuticles, and then I'm going to use the different bits to remove the cuticle debris that's on the natural nail as well as trying to lift up any dead skin on that nail fold. Alright, so all my prep is done. Um, next, we are going to go in and size up our tips. Um, I'm going to do that, which you see I did. Now, here is the step that is optional, but I think is very highly recommended. You can either use your nail drill or you can chemically etch by taking primer and just rubbing it inside there to create a textured surface which will definitely allow for your adhesive to last longer and hang tight to that nail enhancement so I'm gonna do that um, pretty much anywhere that the adhesive is going to go that's why you see it I'm placing it back on my nail just to make sure so today we're gonna be using forever beauties dehydrator I'm gonna be using young nails protein bond also known as the primer or double-sided sticky tape all that stuff I love watching the dehydrators and it's always fun Alrighty, so I'm just gonna get my little Sapland little flash lamp out that we got at, that was in a previous video. Um, the one thing that I don't like about it, the magnet is about not very strong, so even if you like bump it, it just pops off, but I digress. 
So I've already applied my dehydrator and my primer to all my nails and now I am placing some of that base gel on the inside enough that I know it's going to cover it and not hopefully overflow. So when you're working with gel, that stuff can give you a heat spike. You, you saw my finger shake. That was hurting. <laughs> So I just go through the whole process over until I am done with all the fingers. And then I do actually do a full, uh, full cure in the lamp for, for two minutes. Alright, so I'm now using my e-file and I'm using my sanding band I'm going around the edges um, just to make sure that I clean up any spillages. I'm surprised I actually didn't have more. <laughs> um, but then I'm buffing up the entire nail surface because we are going to be applying gel and gel always applies better on a rough surface. Alright, so I'm going to go in with my Forever Beauty base coat, and that's what I'm going to apply to all of my nails. And I was kind of, I'm sure y'all saw in the title already, I've already done a couple fall sets. I'm really excited for Halloween, but I kind of wanted to still do fall, so I'm calling it Falloween. <laughs> it's silly, I know. I'm using this um, DND beautiful color it's a beautiful sparkle jellyish orange and i'm gonna apply a couple of coats of that to anything after the free edge Alright, so after curing for a minute, I'm using my Miss City CS56, which is like an orangey color. Um, very fall, very this time of year, very pumpkin spice, all that good stuff. By the way, are you subscribed? Make sure you are and turn on those bell notifications. So what I'm trying to do here is put a good amount to a certain extent and then I'm going to try and ombre these.
All right, awesome. So after curing, this is kind of what we left with. I'm loving this little ombre glitter yellow moment. I'm using some Enel Couture. Gummy jelly, which is a very thick consistency, kind of like a thicker gel for your hair. And um, just using a flat brush and I'm applying it anywhere that I want to add charms. Hello, Gucci. She's saying hi to everybody. And we are just going to add bling, honey. Y'all know I love the bling. I haven't actually used a lot of bling lately, but y'all keep watching. Hey my loves, thank you so much for making it this far into the video. I really appreciate it. This is just a quick, hey, are you subscribed? If not, definitely hit that subscribe button, turn on those bell notifications so you never miss a post. And let's keep up with these nails, honey. No, wait, really? Are you subscribed? <laughs> if you can, also share the video. That would be awesome. Very much appreciated. Thank you. Love y'all.
So question, do we have any bodied in the Diamond Cub family or anybody out there that likes pumpkin spice? Um, personally, I do like pumpkin spice, but you know, it's one of those things that's like, all right, um, specifically, let's say for a drink or something. I'm not a big fan of the smell, but you know. And also, do y'all have any Halloween traditions that you do every year? Maybe you take your kids out. I remember when I was young, my parents, when we lived in New York, well, my mom would drive me around to her friend's house to get treats from them just because we didn't live in the best neighborhood. So we did not go door to door, honey. <laughs> Hey loves, just popping in. Make sure your bell notifications are turned on. Leave a comment below. Let me know maybe what is your favorite tradition to do during this time of year. This fall, autumn, almost Halloween moment. You know? Alright, so after curing, look at what we got. So I added some different designs. I added some purples. I added some orange stones. I added some greens because I wanted to incorporate both fall and Halloween into this set. I really wanted it to look nice. And now we're going in with Forever Beauty's top coat and we are going to cure for two minutes.
So seeing that I wanted to definitely mix fall and Halloween, those two vibes together, um, I definitely chose stones that I felt resembled that. So I have, you know, the clear stones, I have orange, greens, purples. Hubby was like, that looks like Mardi Gras, and I'm like, yeah it does, but it's also Halloween. <laughs> I think they came out cute. So I'm letting it cool off for two minutes. That lets everything settle out. Now you can have that good anti-scratch. I'm going to add that cuticle oil. Make sure that we are nice and nourished because you know it's important. I love y'all so, so, so much. Pushing out that positive energy. Peace out.